Welcome into the recap of the Cubs 7-3 victory over the White Sox tonight at Guaranteed Rate Field on the south side of the great city of Chicago. I'm David Kaplan. It's brought to you by Chevy Drive, Chicago.com, your Chicagoland Chevy dealers. Folks, Kyle Hendricks was excellent tonight. Six and a third innings. He was really, really locked in early, got tired late. Uh, but Hendricks, six and a third, four hit, three run there earned, four strikeout, one walk baseball. Leiter Jr., Fulmer, and Alzali. Leiter Jr. came in, did the job, and then Fulmer in. And Fulmer was not great at the start of the bottom of the ninth. Walk, hit, you're out. Here comes Alzali and Adbert Alzali. Good morning, good afternoon, and good night. Three strikeouts. Face three guys. Got them all, and the Cubs closed it down. Our four seasons, heating, air conditioning, plumbing, and electric. Player of the game, Dansby Swanson gets that nod. A hundred gold stars for you, my man. Three for three, four RBIs, two home runs. And then Nico Horner deserves some accolades as well. Horner, a three for five night. He had a home run. He had an, uh, the RBI on the home run, and then also had two stolen bases. And how about this nugget from Chris Kampka from NBC Sports Chicago? They call him the cruncher. That's right. The cruncher, the great research man, said the Cubs have had four home runs and five steals in a game one time. Tonight! Tonight! In the Crosstown series. Four homers, five stolen bases. Yasmani Grandal was awful trying to control the running game. But again, it was Hendricks really good. Kopech not so much. And the Cubs win the ball game 7-3. Milwaukee trailing in the ninth to the Reds. So the Cubs would pick up a full game on the Brewers and move to just six games out in the division. Keep stringing wins together. And you're going to force the front office to add on and not trade guys away. That is a fact. You can't blow this thing up if they keep playing this well. Four wins in a row. Cubs look good. And they get Stroman on the bump against Lance Lynn on Wednesday evening. Again, a big night for the offense. Four bombs, five stolen bases for the White Sox. They had a moment, a moment where it looked like they were getting right back in the game. Yohan Moncada looked like he had a grand slam and our 10,000 star play of the game. Wow. Say a Suzuki over the fence to pull it back in a grand slam not to be. Tough night for the White Sox. Cubs win 7-3. Have a great rest of your night. Appreciate you greatly. We'll see you tomorrow on the Rush Hour and then the baseball recap for the series finale. Take that.